Hi everyone, Big Paulie back for a brand new movie review. Just come out of seeing Argyle, the new film from Matthew Vaughan. Uh, all, all I can say is, don't believe the reviews that are saying it's not very good and it's slow and it's crap. Because i got to say, this is the most fun I've had in a cinema since Guardians 3. If you're going into a Matthew Vaughan film, you know what kind of stuff to expect. Your kick-ass, your Kingsman, that sort of thing. And this fits right in with his type of storytelling. Okay, so what's it about without spoiling it? And believe me, you can spoil this film. Yeah, um, okay, so Bryce Dallas Howard plays Ellie Conway, who's a, uh, a spy espionage author, a bit like Ian Fleming. And she writes these novels about, you know, a secret agent uh, and a big agency and espionage and all that kind of stuff. There's digital files in there. There's there's good there's good guys. There's bad guys. You've got Sam Rockwell. You've got Henry Cavill, and you've got Heisenberg himself from Breaking Bad. Now the beginning of the film. The first fifteen minutes, I kind of felt like this was a Bond film. It. It fitted right in to the beginning of a Bond film before the title sequence came up. And it just had that feel and that grandeur and that look to it. But all I'm going to say is there's guns, there's knives, there's martial arts, uh, there's twists. Believe me, there are twists I did not see coming in this film. It looks gorgeous and I'm telling you now, it looks absolutely fantastic on that IMAX screen. The sound was incredible as well, but visually it looked incredible. There are some scenes towards the end of the film that are jaw dropping. They just look incredible. Uh, something you know, you've not seen before. I saw a few people mention that the pacing was off. I didn't think the pacing was off at all in the film. It was about two hours, 10 minutes, two hours, 15 minutes. There was no slow bits, you know, there was, it did slow down a little bit to talk about the dialogue and, and the characters and that, but I thought it I thought it was perfectly paced. And even though this film was a 12A, it, there was a lot of death in the film. Yeah, uh, maybe not so much blood, uh, but there were certainly a, a few people that uh, bit the bullet. So yes, if you was wondering whether or not to go and see it and you read a few reviews and they said it's not a very good film, don't believe reviews, don't read reviews, just make your own mind up, go and see it for yourself. Because I had read a few reviews on IMDb, they were giving it like 5, 6 out of 10, and uh, if I had taken their notice and not gone to see it, I would have missed out on a thrilling two-hour action-adventure comedy spy espionage film. To so go and watch it on the biggest screen you possibly can and make your own mind up. Stay to the end as well because there is a kind of a mid-credit scene, very interesting mid-credit scene. Uh, there isn't anything right at the end after the credits, uh, but uh, I thought it was great. The music was great. All the acting was great. The look of it, it felt like a Matthew Vaughan film. I love Kingsman. I love Kick-Ass and I loved this film. It just fitted perfectly for me. Fantastic. And one other thing. Uh, yes, there is a cat in it, as you can see in the trailer. And um, I've got to say now, I already know what the steelbook's going to look like. <laughs> It's going to look like that. If that is not the steel book, I'll strip down, run around in Cineworld naked. <laughs> That's got to be a steel book. Please make that a steel book. Yeah, fantastic. So absolutely love the film. I definitely give that a big poorly recommendation. So yeah, go and see Argyle. 
fantastic. So there we go. So that's my little review of Argyle. I didn't want to go into it too much because there are some spoilers. There are some spoilers in this film and uh, you could easily ruin this film for, for anybody else. So yeah, go and enjoy the film and uh, just sit back, get a big popcorn or take, smuggle some stuff in and uh, just have a really great time for two and, hour, two and a bit hours. Fantastic. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Like it by giving it some thumbs up. Blah, 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 blah. Don't forget to subscribe, comment and share. And I'll see you on the next video very soon. Bye bye.